guys, it's me, Tay with Love, and I'm back with another unboxing video. So this is Blackpink's Summer Diary and so so uh, let's get started. So here is the Blackpink 2020 Summer Diary in Seoul. So this is the DVD. I didn't buy the video kit just because I I think it's pretty useless for me. I don't really care about it. So I only bought the DVD, which I think is a lot more worth it if you say so myself. But yes, this is the front. It says their Blackpink and here's some more integrated details. This is their YG. I think this is the same size as the welcoming collection. Um, it's the same. I think it's the same size. Just like all of their merch, it's all the same size. Here's the back. This is their 2020 Blackpink Summer Diary in Seoul. Here we have English and it has Korean, English, Japanese, and Chinese subtitles. And 7 to 8 minutes worth of content here's another side top and bottom so let's get started there you go so here's a more clear view definitely the same texture as the welcoming collection it's matte and has a little bit of gloss as you can see. So yeah, let's um, open this baby up already. Oh my god! So here is the box. It is pink. It's so pretty. Love that. So basically, I think the theme of this black pink one is a green. Just like the 2019 one. It's also green, the Hawaii version. And here are the goodies. I'm so excited to unbox this with you guys. So let's start off with the postcards. So here you go. And here is the case. It's really cute. It's glittery. So that's Rosé. Over here, here's the back. It has a neat black pink summer diaries. Rosé. Then Lisa. Again, this is a Jisoo. Ooh. Got Jisoo again, and then we have Jenny. Jenny, and here are the stickers. So these are 2020 Blackpink Summer Diary in Seoul. And here are the pink ones. So there is a green and a pink version for the stickers. And here are all the postcards of everyone. Oh my god, look at Jenny here though, by the way. So moving on, here we have the photo cards. So the photo cards looks like this. It's um, a lot of photo cards, as you can see. I think it's, again, three by a member. So let's open this up. Okay, so here we have Jenny, Jenny, and then Rosé, then Jisoo, oh she looks so pretty here. Under Jisoo, and here we have Lisa. Mm. So these are all of the photo cards for the photo card set. Next we have the um, mask strap. So this is the one you use um, when you put on the mask and you attach it to the mask where um, 
to like that string on your mask that you put behind your ear you put that string with this one i don't know what you call it but this is a mask strap if you know what i mean you get what i mean yeah whatever so it says they're black pink if you could see it clearly there you go so that is the mask strap next here we have the dvd oh my god so here is the DVD says they're 2020 Blackpink Summer Diary and so and right there in the back it says they're YG Entertainment. Here is the DVD. It's green, you guys. It's so pretty, isn't it? It says they're it says um Blackpink Summer Diary. It's so it's green and pink. Love the design of the DVD. Personally, I love the design. Because black green DVDs tend to be really simple and minimalistic, so I'm glad that they tried to change it up a bit. Next, here we have the Polaroid and sticker set. So let's open this up. So here we have the Polaroids. By the way, it's different, depends on which Polaroids you get. So we have Lisa. This is the back. Elisa. Then we got Jisoo. Jenny. And Rose. Then here we have the group pictures. It's their 2020 Blackpink Summer Diary in Seoul. Here's the other group picture. Here's the back. Yeah, that is all the Polaroids for this album. For uh, not this album, but this DVD. And then next, we're going to unbox the photo book. So I know everyone's waiting for this. So here's the front. This is the side, and here is the back. So it's their black, pink, summer days, and so I'm very excited, as much as you are. <laughs> so let's get started. Wow, look at this, you guys. So, of course, the first page is Jisoo. By the way, she's going to act in a drama. Are you guys excited for that? I got Rose and Jenny. So, this one is in back in Korea. Here you have Lisa. It is, um, since because of the pandemic going on, we can't really like. Um, go outside and travel so Blackpink decided to just be like in Korea because that's a little much safer option for their health and um, for that, not just for Blackpink but for everybody you know traveling right now is a really supervised like it's not really a recommended thing because who knows might get the virus which we're trying to prevent can't really spread it right now but yes oh my god look at jenny though i really like her um this her new hairstyle she changed it though um since ice cream era but her highlight the era is really just perfect i love her um music show clothes it really fits her well same thing goes to <clears throat> sorry for my voice um same thing goes to rose like Rose has this like purple hair, which I really am a fond of Because she always stuck with this like like blondish Hair back in uh, Kill this love She like stuck with her hair for a year. So it kind of just like You know she needs to change up her hairstyle So I'm glad she started to change her hairstyle more often now <laughs> Ooh, Jisoo. Oh my god, Lisa! Oh my god, you guys look at Lisa though. I see that? She's so cute. She's been bias wrecking me. Her iconic line <laughs> in Ice Cream. What's it called again? Le like Mona There's something like these lines between Mona Lisa and Lisa. It's just, it's, it's just so funny. <laughs> I saw the English translation. It, some of them lyrics make sense. Some of them like has this double meaning that I still don't get from till from till day, today. Like they have this like double meaning, and sometimes I don't get it. Like I just don't get it. 
I don't get I don't know what the wrong, what is wrong with the songwriter but <laughs> I guess that's what it is with um, lyrics I guess a lot of them has double meanings and ice cream does too yeah by the way what do you guys think about ice cream I really like it it's their best collaboration I don't I was not to be honest with you I was not a really big fan of Lady Gaga and Blackpink's collab Sour Candy it was too short and not my type of style to be honest so I'm really glad that ice cream really like set the standard for collaborations because that was such a bop I love it Selena Gomez was so pretty in the music video she definitely fit the whole concept of Blackpink they're black pink oh my god look at lisa <gasps> pretty very pretty she's been bias wrecking me throughout the whole era working all of a sudden <laughs> so sorry for that oh yes so yeah, anyways moving on here we have the photo book my camera just stopped working and i'm sorry for that so i had to resume it but anyways here's the girls Ooh, love Jenny's um, pants. It has like this um, daisy or flowers going on it. Ooh, look at Rizé. Oh, jeez, you too. You're so hot. Also, by the way, I encourage you guys to stream ice cream right now. Um, like, the comeback day for ice cream was such a mess. Like, it was such a stressful day for me. Like, so much was going on. If you don't know what was going on in comeback day, but you're probably missing a lot. But there's just so much, like, stuff going on back then. It was, it, I, I hated it. I hated that day. Like, even though it was a day to celebrate Blackpink, it, there was like so much solo stance, a lot of fan words, it, was really, it, it gives me headache, you guys. So, I encourage you guys to stream ice cream. Because we're really so disappointed, I was so disappointed with us. Um, we didn't even reach a goal as well, so yeah, please stream ice cream. So yes, this is the photo book. Love, love the photo book. And here we have a file of like these like black pink photos it's so huge i really liked it so let's start off um so yeah here is the like a little folder piece going on so let's start with jenny okay right over here is the back so start 2020 black pink so i so and i'm guessing this is the same pattern for like three each member there you go it's jenny then got lisa and jisoo and rose so that is for the photo files and next, here we have the individual solo posters. So each member of Blackpink has their own solo poster. Here we have Jisoo. Really pretty. Next one, let's see what we got. Here we have Lisa. This is Lisa's solo poster. Next, let's see who is this. This one is Jenny. And lastly, here we have Rose. Our beautiful Horizon Puck. Yes, so that is the 
individual solo posters. I love now that there's individual solo posters. They used to have these random solo posters. So I'm grateful that now they're all members. All of them. So thank you guys very, very much if you've come a long, long ways. And yeah, thank you guys again so, so much. Next unboxing, I'm not really sure, but for the future, I'll be unboxing the Blackpink The Album in October. So make sure to give this video a big thumbs up make sure to like subscribe and comment down below for a shout out and make sure to also follow my all social medias again it'll be the link in the description box below thank you guys so much thank you blinks for watching this video hope you enjoyed a lot as much as i did bye, -bye. thank you guys so so much see you in the next video